facial spasms, what exactly happens is that one part of the person's face starts repeatedly contracting as if somebody is pulling this part of the face from inside. So as the person starts talking, the face starts getting repeatedly drawn towards one side, something like this. When I am talking, if, I, if my face starts twitching towards this side, this is exactly how the hemifacial spasms would look. The eyes close, one side, that is one eye closes and the cheek gets pulled to one side. Now this is a basically cosmetically very very embarrassing situation for that person because in any social interaction the person is not very confident. So we get many patients who are young and uh, who go for job interviews and they are rejected because of this. There are many people who have uh, social commitments, they like social interactions, uh, they are in deep trouble, people who like to go to parties, they are in deep trouble. So in short, as the disease progresses, the person starts becoming uh, very very lonely and uh, cannot mix in the society very freely. And this itself changes the pattern of life. Some people do try a temporary measures like Botox, but Botox actually uh, paralyzes the muscles temporarily and sometimes after taking Botox the expressions on that part of the face are lost so face can look mask like so what exactly what exactly is the answer to this problem the answer lies in the surgery called as microvascular decompression and it is one of the best answers to this uh, problem because it has got a potential, I would say more than 98% potential uh, to cure this problem.